Well, hello, my darlings, and welcome back to another episode of DIY 101 with yours truly, moi. On today's episode, I'm going to show you how to prepare a one container, two part epoxy. I hope you'll stay tuned. So now here is the container that the two part epoxy comes in. I toggle between one brand or the other. And if you can see, this container has two cylindrical parts of it, but it's actually contained into one package, if you will. And so one side of the package holds the adhesive while the other side of the package actually holds the hardener. And so to use this, what you're going to do is take off the top, okay? Place your epoxy by squeezing equal parts. Now the reason why I like this is because you do not have to pour in the equal parts and measure it for yourself. You're simply going to squeeze by depressing your plunger. And once you do that, equal parts of this epoxy is going to come out into your container. Once you have gotten the amount of epoxy that you need, it is simply a matter of closing your container back. I'll get that off camera in the essence of time taking your tongue depressor or whatever else you're using to mix your epoxy, mixing those two pieces around for about 15 to 20 seconds to make sure that you have both parts nice and equally mixed together. And once you have done that for about 20 seconds, your epoxy is ready to use. Now we know from working with me on my channel already that when you are using epoxy on glass on glass, those two glass pieces are going to slip and slide. And so the best way to handle that is of course to place your glass one on top of the other and hold them in place until your epoxy sets. It usually takes an epoxy about three to five minutes to start to harden. And once you have met that threshold, then holding your items together usually will no longer be mandatory, but holding them for an additional maybe one to two minutes would be good enough just to be sure that that epoxy has set into place. Well, there you have it. The plunger is key when working with a one container, two part epoxy. You do want to make sure that you're getting equal portion of the adhesive that is mixed with an equal portion of the hardener and once you have gotten both parts out of the container, you want to make sure that you mix that epoxy for about 15 to 20 seconds for equal distribution of both sides. My darlings, I sure hope that this information has been helpful to you. And until next time, I say to you, please, please, please take care of yourselves for me. Know that I love you all. Mwah, mwah. <laughs> Bye now.